Welcome to ChemExam Explained, where the aim is chemistry clarity, exam mastery. In today's video, we will be looking at CSEC Chemistry, May, June 2012, question number six. Let's go. 6A. Scientists believe that without water, all life would cease to exist. Outline three properties of water and relate them to its function in maintaining life on Earth. In answering the question, we will start with the density of water. So density of water decreases as it freezes so that ice floats on water. This is vital to life in temperature regions where ice forms on the surface of water bodies and act as an insulating layer for aquatic life during winter. Two, water is a good solvent. It dissolves oxygen, which is necessary for aquatic life. Water is also used in various metabolic processes. Three, water has a relatively high heat capacity. This allows mammals to maintain a constant body temperature during external temperature changes. 6b part 1. State the meaning of the term hard water. Hard water is water which contains dissolved calcium and magnesium ions. 6b part 2. Describe one way in which water can be softened. Include a chemical reaction with state symbols in your description. Water can be softened by adding sodium carbonate. Sodium carbonate reacts with the dissolved salts, forming insoluble carbonates. So this is an ionic equation showing you what takes place to form the insoluble calcium carbonate. And this removes calcium or magnesium from the water. So what happens is that the calcium carbonate is displaced from water. Now sodium carbonate is soluble and it reacts with calcium in the form of calcium hydrogen carbonate, which is a soluble form in the water. So what will happen now is the sodium will displace the calcium and the calcium will take the sodium's place because sodium is more rapid than calcium. So we will form now sodium hydrogen carbonate, which is in the soluble form. So you won't see anything in terms of a precipitate for this plus calcium carbonate. So the sodium in sodium carbonate displaces the calcium from the calcium hydrogen carbonate, forming sodium hydrogen carbonate plus calcium carbonate. So this is in dissolved form, so you won't see any precipitate where this is concerned, but the calcium carbonate will give you a white precipitate. And that is how we remove calcium from the water. And the same thing would happen in the case of magnesium. 6C. It is important that communities and individual households play a part in the management and preservation of the environment. Suggest four practical ways in which households or communities can manage or preserve the environment. At least one way must be related to water. Now we could look at the three R's as part of our answer. So the first way is we could reduce the consumption of water by taking shorter showers. We could recycle plastics or bottles instead of sending them to the landfills. We could reuse glass bottles instead of discarding them. And we could use paper bags instead of plastic bags. This is the end of CSEC Chemistry, May, June 2012 question number six. Please remember to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell so that when new videos are uploaded, you will be notified. Thank you.